In this video, you'll learn when and how best to use the liquid video transition, which looks something like this. This series of short videos teaches you how to master and use transitions correctly by explaining the fundamental theory and the ground rules for each transition type, giving you all the confidence to use transitions in your video productions. When used correctly, video transitions can add a whole new dimension to your content creation and make your videos look professional, just like a boss. But be careful. Overdoing transitions or using them in the wrong way can have the opposite undesirable effect. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to this channel so you never miss out on any of the cool videos we'll be releasing and help you use transitions like a pro. Are you ready? Let's check it out. So from the name Liquid Transition, you can already deduce and predict that this transition will consist of a liquid-like motion meaning a natural flow movement transition between any two clips for a natural but creative look. Since liquids flow in different ways and at different speeds, this category offers enough variations to the liquid flow, making it a versatile category. Let's see how this will come together. What better way to try out the liquid transition than to use it with footage shot with a liquid environment, such as this YouTube cooking show promo that we're putting together. So we're going to put together a bunch of clips showing several food items that are being tossed around with water in the background, you know, really cool shots. And then we apply the liquid transition between each of these clips for a truly dramatic and cool effect. The best part of it is the liquid transition is in harmony with the liquid footage for a perfect match. Looks pretty cool, right? So the liquid transition is an easy choice when your footage involves liquids or water and can be equally effective for any footage that involves water such as water sports, surfing, swimming, that sort of stuff. But don't forget the golden rule of not overdoing it. This means because there are many different variations of the liquid transition, just pick a few, one or two, and use them sparingly throughout. This will make your production look more professional. So go ahead and give the liquid transition a try in your very next project. So I hope you found this video useful and if you haven't done so, hit that like button and make sure you subscribe to our channel for more great content like this. Speak to you in the next video.